Hey guys, welcome to a new video of Bitcoin Edge. And um, well, it's going to be a little bit of a short one because we're already looking at it. The monthly close was a monster candle. Um, the weekly will be looking good, but right now um, we're in this. We're in a wedge, tightening wedge. And um, I mean, you could say it is, it is like uh, a continuation wedge. It's getting very tight now. Um, I'm long, but um, yeah, the, I can I can say a lot of stuff about it. But um, a retest of 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 three and a half thousand could be um, possible as well. Or we just go making one of those table tops where we go sideways a little um, and and just consolidate. Um, so yeah, that that is about it. Uh, I, I can make a I can make a long story. I can make a short story. But uh, for now, this is it. We can take a look at the weekly right now. Bitcoin is going, breaking to the downside a little. Um, funding still negative. Um, really weird. We haven't seen that like in a long time. So that makes me bullish. Um, that makes for aggressive moves to the upside. If we look in history over here, over here we were negative, very negative, and we pumped up. Um, S&P 500 and the Dixie are of course very important for us um, and we have elections coming. Uh, people are saying Bitcoin is not correlating with uh, boomer stocks anymore but it is. It really is. Uh, of course um, on, on, on lower time frames it is really correlating. Um, of course um, Bitcoin can move higher up um, but if it dumps you know it's, it's really hard. Um, to pump it harder because it's either risk on or risk off um, so yeah that is about it for me Bitcoin right now is breaking to the downside let's see where we have supports around the five minute time frame very small time frame um, but you can see over here um, zoom out a little bit I expect um, yeah around um, well, this is showing a different level, but um, I would say uh, 13,500 is a good place to step in again. That would be at this area, a little bit higher, sorry, over here. That would be a buying moment for me. It's also very much protected in the order books. And of course, uh, we have a lot of support over here as well, um, but 13. 1500 is very protected in the order books um, we saw a little bit of an ethereum pop and yeah it is still it doesn't dump with bitcoin we're on the daily it's a bit too soon maybe a bit too tight maybe but yeah it's still looking good ethereum um, for me i like the bigger patterns uh, a bit more but yeah really nice breakout on a lower time frame but for me this is what counts for ethereum BT, uh, BT, yeah, sorry, Ethereum USD. Um, this is Ethereum BTC for me. It finally bounced, looking good. Um, so yeah, I, I mean, I'm afraid. Afraid. Um, I think BTC could stall here a little bit, consolidate a little bit, um, just go up and down a little bit, a little bit of chopping, um, and just building up for the next big move so i think that the next day we will uh yeah be in between 14,000 and uh, 13,000 maybe a scam week but um yeah i expect us to be close around these levels just go sideways make a little bit of a tabletop is how i like to call it um, if we zoom out we see uh, a lot of those patterns lately um, over here we had a nice tabletop over here we had a small one over here we had a small one, just some consolidation patterns. Other people like to call it a BART, but I think we just consolidate around here a little bit. Um, I mean, I'm still long, just in case um, invalidation for me would be, I think, sub 11K. And in the bull market, you know, things like that can happen. Look at this one. This is a really big bull market, $2 candle to the, to the downside, just to shake everybody out. Um, yeah, I mean, there's not much I can say about it. 
I can make a story up, but yeah, we want to be honest in here. We see um, a real resistance line here as well, just like we saw in the other one, of course. See something from here. Yeah, we could say something like this as well. Anyway, guys, I'm uh, I'm having some trouble with my um, little breakdown here, but uh, I mean, it, it it's not worrying me. Um, anyway, do you guys have any tips for my microphone settings? Because it's it's freaking me out. I have a, a Hyperix Quadcast, and um, I can't get it to sound right. See you guys again tomorrow. This was it. Let me know what you guys think uh, what Bitcoin is going to do. And uh, like I said, I'll see you guys again tomorrow.